Hey guys, so by now you've had a chance to look at our data. You probably also thought about some different ways that we can come up with one typical number to represent the data in each treatment. There are different ways that scientists will come up with one number to represent a group of numbers. Sometimes they might calculate the range, which is the difference between the smallest number and the biggest number, while other times they might use something like the median or the mode. For our purposes though, we're going to be using the mean or the average number. You can calculate the average of a set of numbers by adding all of those numbers together and then dividing by the total number of things that are in that group. To start analyzing the data set, you'll need to calculate the average change in seedling size for seedlings in each of our three treatments, our woody mulch, our straw-like mulch, and our no mulch. Once you calculate those numbers, we can think about how we want to display them in a graph. 